All right, the little minute clock is pinning there, and that means I think that, uh, by golly, it's time to start my movie. And uh, this is Harsh, and uh, coming back to you from, uh, this is from one of my uptown office, and uh, it's kind of a nice place to talk. You can see here where I'm at, actually kind of in bed, but uh, they tell me that you can still get rich in bed, so that's what I want to do. I just want to get rich, so I'm here to talk to you. And I got a special project. Well, right now, if you hear some noise in the background, I was watching American Idol. And I'm going to take it over and show you how I got my setup there. My TV is American Idol on. So sometimes I may not be paying quite as much attention to making the video here that I should be. But uh, I'm going to do the best I can under them circumstances. Today I'm going to talk to you about some of my favorite things. These are my absolute favorite things. And uh, the first one I'm going to tell you about is Velveeta cheese. I mean, I've been eating, <laughs> I've been eating Velveeta cheese since I was just about knee high to a grasshopper. I was two years old. My dad gave me a slice of Velveeta cheese, and I've been eating it ever since. In fact, all my kids for Christmas, that's all they ever give me, and that's almost like a commercial. So if you're out there and you work for the the uh, the craft company and you sell Velveeta cheese, you should be paying harsh to be selling this cheese for you because it is, by golly, I mean, it's the only real cheese on the market. So what can I say? There you go. In fact, I like it so much that uh, I've been kind of taking me some slices here tonight. And I uh, um, don't know why I like it so much, but it just kind of gummy. It doesn't stick to your teeth. And it's just really good stuff. So, but tonight I got a special, I mean, a special project I want to share with you. Everybody knows that I got my old uh, horse shit, horse IT game, and it's going gangbusters. I tell you something, after I got and sold that one to the Obamas, and then they had me send one out to every other, every other diplomatic person out there that they's in uh, cahoots with, and uh, uh, people that them in taking their bribes and not taking their bribes, but they said, hey, we can use your horse shit game for a bribe. So just would you send it to this address? And I said, well, just send me the money. And that's all it got to do. So, but tonight, I got something I want to tell you about. This here. This here. Everybody knows what this is. One thing about this, it just ain't quite as much fun as this. <laughs> There's something I like about this. This is a full wine glass. So what I'm going to be trying to do tonight is I'm going to be telling some horseshit engraved wine glasses that you can give your friends as that gift that they just will keep on giving. And you can see eventually here I've got my fancy new engraving equipment that my, my director, my manager, he bought me. He said, Hosh, you can use this engraving equipment. And I don't know if I can do that and make a movie at the same time, but by golly, I'm going to make up something here. And I'm going to put uh, your name engraved on this wine glass. And it's going to say uh, compliments of horseshit for, let's make up some crazy name like, uh, uh, let's go with uh, just uh, uh, John Wayne. John Wayne, he's just a normal guy. And uh, by golly, we're going to do that. So just uh, well, give me a minute here. I'm going to see if I can get to my other program. And I'm going to get right here. Here it is, by golly. And uh, we're, whoops, crap. Stay there. Now, okay, this is what I said we're going to call this going to be horse, horse, horse shit gift for you. It's spelled for you there. John, for you. John, dead gum. Why'd they put an H in the name John? It just would take so much less time if I could just type it like I usually do, J O N. But they put a crappy O H right there, and so it takes me time to get that right. John Wayne. And crap, I'm even misspelled horseshoe. That's my own business that I misspelled that freaking thing. Okay, by golly, now I'm gonna sit and I'm gonna see if I don't know if I can show you this or not, but uh. I'm going to come over here. I can't show you the screen because I ain't got that much figured out yet. I don't even know if I'm showing up yet. But I'm going to hit this uh, this print button right here. And I'm going to show you my engraving machine and how it's working. If I can hit... Where is it? Where's that icon here? Right there. Up. My hand's backwards, so it's hard to do this. Okay, back. 
Okay, what am I gonna have to do to hit this one? Somebody gonna hit this one here. You gotta be seeing this. This has gotta be the most. Yeah, ridiculous thing. Back to idle. 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 Back to Get rid of all this other stuff here and go back to my my movie making machine here, which is right here. Here I am. Okay, by God, I just engraved horseshit gift for you, John Wayne, and I'm going to show you how this works. And I call this my new horseshit in wine glass engraver. And if you will just write to me and go to my website www.horseshit.com, and if you can't afford the glass. And if you're like me, you're busy using the glass, then you write to me, and I will try and send you an engraved document that you can put right on your own glass. I do recommend that you just wait until it's empty, but by God, I'm even going to show you my production secret here. You take your glass here, and you spin that around like that, and by God, right in front of your very own eyes, you got one genuine almost crystal glass engraved with horse shit it doesn't have the trademark thing but pretend it's there because i just couldn't figure that part out this fast for you a gift for you john wayne by golly and that's what you gotta do to get your own horse shit engraved label or if you will just send me twenty dollars i will send you a glass with this label copyrighted trademarked and protected and you can play your game of horse shit with your new engraved horseshit glasses. And that's about what all I got to say about that. So, if you don't mind, I'm just going to have me one more glass of wine and a slice of cheese. And this is what I love eating Belvedere cheese. You put it on a knife like this. I used to, when I was a kid, I thought this was as good as a popsicle. I would, my mom would cut me off a piece, leave it on the knife, and I would walk around the house. I will just be eating that thing. I will be so happy. In fact, someday I'm going to tell you some stories about me and my mom and growing up and what life was like. And that ain't no horseshit. <laughs> That's kind of a play on words right there. That's a play on words. Okay, so hey, I'm going to find the pause button. Marcia, can you, uh, can you just come over here and get my glasses here? And I want to see if I can get them shipped off to some of my friends. And we're going to just sell lots of this stuff. So 20 bucks will get you an engraved genuine, a genuine, genuine by me engraved wine glass. Thank you much. Here's a stop right there.